what's going on guys Moxification here so today uh, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can set up uh, RPC tools if you don't know what that is I'll give you an example so uh, something like either JTAG toolbox or uh, a tool that you would use to change your gamer tag on Modern Warfare 3 or Modern Warfare 2 or any other COD so uh, to start off uh, you're going to want to be able to set up neighborhood so I have done a video on that uh, and once you've uh, basically set it up and everything uh, everything but the basically the video will be in the description um so you can go and watch that and it's really easy really quick uh but yeah so once you've done that um you want to make sure it has the tick next to your jtag uh if you can see that right there like the big orange tick uh you want to basically go into jtag and you're going to go into uh go into retail hard drive emulation uh and from here you want to download the files that I have uh, given provided also which will be in the description um, and it will probably be under or above the uh, the how to set up neighborhood uh, and what you'll get is xpdm.xex, xrpc.xex, rpc.xex, jrpc.xex and launch.ini um, so some people will be saying you don't need all three of these I use all three um, because there's some tools that I use where you need one of them but you don't need the others and then there's another tool where you need two of them and it just you know it works better if i just have all three um so yeah uh so what you're gonna do is you're gonna open up the launch ani first and you're basically gonna scroll down down to where it says plugins now for you um i don't know if you have a server um if you connect to a server uh, for for the Xbox Live Stealth, or if you have offline file files and you need to uh, have one of them as a plugin, um, but if you do, you just want to rename this one here to that, um, and you want to leave all the others the same, um, and then you want to save it. So, like for example, if you had let's just say XBLSC, uh, I think it's XBLSC.xex or Xbox Live Stealth. Um, dot uh, xex if it's that just do that but yeah mine is xbl bypassed dot uh, xex and then you just uh, control s or file save exit out of that literally just get all of these put them into the root of your hard drive i'm not going to do that because mine's all set up and everything uh but yeah and then one, once you've done that you're just going to turn off your xbox turn it back on um, and once it's back on, you're just, uh, I'm just going to open this up so you can see, you're going to find a tool, um, the tools that I quite like to use often are like DIOS or, um, uh, let me open up a Black Ops 2 one, uh, Black Ops 2, uh, has, there you go, this one, and let me go on Black Ops 2 real quick, oh, I don't know what happened there, there you go, there you go, there you go, uh, we'll go on Black Ops 2 real quick. Uh, there you go. Black Ops 2. Uh, and I'll make this a bit bigger as well so you can see it better. Ah, actually, you know what? I just double click. And then I'll go like that. There you go. Uh, has BR2. There you go. Opened. Uh, I hope it doesn't, uh not work uh not 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 work i'm all right whatever i'm i'm going on uh we're going we'll go on xbox live because i am online uh i don't know what account there you go modded lobsters uh so once you're there once you're signed in or whatever for whatever game you're doing uh you're just gonna click uh you're gonna click connect on the tool and that's gonna connect to your console there you go connection success for uh have fun modding okay and then i'm gonna go to the black ops 2 section you got red boxes on, V set on, no recoil on, and champs. I don't know what champs is. It's taken a long time to sign in. Uh, but yeah, so you literally. Oh, I thought it just worked. And there you go, it worked. So now we're gonna go on Xbox Live, and that's gonna take another year. Ah, oh, my internet's so bad. All right, well there you go. So uh, once I'm in the game, I'll show you. Um, there you go. Alright, here we go. Custom game, start the game. Everything just takes so long. I don't know why it takes so long. Uh, but yeah. So, here we go. Alright, the game's starting. Ah, finally. Alright, years after years of time. The longness is real. Alright, here we go, here we go. So, I'm in the game right now. 
Uh, and I'm just waiting for the bots to spawn in. There we go. It's not modded any. Uh, it's not modded in any way yet, as you can see. But then the second I click, red box is on, V set on, no recoil on, and shams. It's all modded, you know. Uh, you can see the people on the map. You can see all of that stuff. Uh, you can see the people, um, and that's a really slow sensitivity. I just kill one of them real quick. So there you go, and you can see there's no recoil, and it's all good. So yeah, that's gonna be about it. Uh, thanks guys, modification, and uh, if this didn't work or something um, for some reason doesn't work or whatever, uh, just contact me like Skype or whatever, and I will. Uh, I'll tr I'll really try to help you, you know. Uh, but it should work, you know. Like there's a, I can almost guarantee that it will work. Uh, but yeah, that's about it. Uh, thanks guys, modification, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.